Hey guys, it's Anthony Subaru Service. I got Tim's truck here. I think it's a 07, pretty sure. Uh, but um, it's smoking, smoking when it's running, when it's idling, and when it's driving. Uh, went ahead and checked the usual. Uh, EGR valve is okay, which just bone dry. It's bone dry down in there. It's it's not wet at all. Kind of see no pulling, no water, no coolant, no nothing in there. Uh, so the next usual culprit is going to be possible turbo. Okay, let me see if I can get this apart and get you to see in there. See that glistening going on in there? See how wet that is? Let's see if I can get it any closer. Maybe I can turn it upside down and get it in there so you can see it better. Hang on just a second, bear with me here. Hang on. I'm getting there. Hold up. Okay, see all that wetness in there? See how wet that is? It's wet, right? screwdriver right in there right where the tip of the screwdriver is see how wet that is that is gonna be a turbo seal let me show you my finger here and go wipe in it oh, I'm upside down all right there you go right here I'll rub it inside of there yeah so the other what we got to do is get this turbo off and be ready with a new turbo because there's like a 1% chance, real low chance, that we have got, uh, it kinda had a little uneven crank. A little bit. Um, so, what I'd like to do is uh, yank this turbo off, be ready with a new turbo, just in case on the Y pipe side over here, the inlet to the exhaust, make sure that there's no oil on that side of it. Because if there is oil on the inlet side of the turbo, then we're looking at a base engine issue. Uh, it's very rare. It's not a, you know, it, it's 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 not by far is it not as common as the turbo. Uh, but there is that chance that you know the oil is coming in from the engine and uh, going through the turbo, and that's why I'm seeing it at the exhaust. But I do not want to compromise the Y pipe by bending it backwards for inspection. Uh, we know the turbo is gonna have to come off. If it's base engine issue, the turbo has to come off. Well, and if it's a turbo seal, the turbo has to come off. So let's yank the freaking turbo to inspect the Y pipe. If the Y pipe is dry and we take the turbo off, it's all good, put the turbo on it, he's gone, done deal. Uh, if it's wet on the Y pipe side, which is not the side we look at there, it's the other side back over there. If that is wet, this engine's coming out. Um, so we'll, uh, we'll have to be ready, get a turbo, and uh, go ahead and yank this one. And then if I do see oil on the Y pipe side, I will be making another video. If not, it's just gonna be just plain Jane drop turbo in it. There you go. Uh, it is gonna smoke a little bit once we put the new turbo on because the exhaust is completely coated. You know, exhaust, uh, muffler, catalytic converter, all that stuff is completely coated with oil. So it's gonna smoke for a little bit once we uh, do the repair, if it is just the turbo, uh, it's to be expected. Um, but other than that, I think we're, uh, we're just looking at a turbo and uh, yeah, that'll be it. All right, have a good day guys.